this camp of exploitation and a lonely death. Only Glenn knows the way to salvation and in the port. This Hey you! Where do you think you're going? Who are you? Another one of them, are you? You think you can wander in here and start asking questions and demanding things, do you? Well, you'd better keep your weapon sheathed and your hands to yourself. That way we won't have any trouble with each other, okay? What is this place? It's a refuge. The last refuge from the Alb converters for many. For others, it is a stronghold of freedom. For me, it is my mission in life. Everyone looking for protection will find it here with us. That is my promise. You, however, don't look like you need protection. So, that makes me wonder. If you're not here seeking refuge, what are you looking for? What do you do here? I take care of Origin's defenses. If you believe in a dream, you have to protect it. And how is that job going? Why the interest in our defenses? Who sent you? I'm just making conversation. Conversation? And it just happens to be about our defenses. Don't think you can get around me that easily, asshole. I really am just making conversation. Sure. Right. Let's speak straight and keep things clear. I see you step out of order here, I will have you put down. I believe in these people, and I don't know who you are. I understand. I guess time will tell, won't it? How did you end up here? Me? I used to be a guard in the domed city. Then I got sent to the front during one of the Alba attacks that were happening back then. We were told we were going there to help the farmers. We got no mercy from the Albs and we gave none back. And the people trapped between us? I don't know how they survived. And after it was done and all those bodies were piled up, we turned around and went straight back to the city and just left those people out here to fend for themselves. That didn't seem right to me. So when I heard rumors about Origin and the help it offered people, well, I came here to find something that was actually worth fighting for. What can I do to help people here? You really want to do that? Well, we can always do with more weapons. But above all, we need more people. Experienced people to help defend this place. So you want me to find people with combat skills for you? Exactly. People you can rely on. Loyal people you can trust. Farmers and refugees here, they do their best. We need some real fighters. People who've been out in the wilderness and survived. If you meet anyone out there you'd trust to watch your back, who'd fight alongside you, well, I guess you can tell them where we are, and that they'd be welcome here in Origin. If I find anyone I can trust, I'll send them here. You will? Okay, then. All right. It'll be good to have some more companions out here who understand what they're doing. At least three would help. That would make good our losses. Ray, an outlaw, has agreed to help. He'll be useful, just don't leave anything shiny around when he's nearby. As if we didn't have enough crooks in camp already. So just know you're responsible for him and anything he takes. That's good for a start. Who else can you offer? I met Duras, a berserker warrior. He's agreed to travel with me, and will stay here in between. Good. Great. The berserkers know how to defend themselves. Have you found anyone else? Crony U-4 is an ALB fighting drone. I've given him orders to help defend Origin. An ALB drone? And you trust it not to go all end of days and start killing us? Hope you're right. Okay. I would say that's enough fighters to make our camp safe. I mean, any more would be welcome, but you've taken the pressure off us for now. I just hope they can work together. We can do without arguments here. But I suppose we'll find out when the next mutant attack comes. Hey, that was great. 